What is going on everyone? I'm Rylan and welcome back to another video talking about CMU emulation for Toys to Life games. And in today's video, uh, we're going to be discussing Disney Infinity. So, yeah, and I got this the request to do this because I wasn't going to do this because um, I have no interest myself in Disney Infinity. But, um, Ms. Ox 13 requested it, so I'm just going to show him how to do it. So, you want to go to the CMU website, like we've done a few times if you've been following my tutorials, and CMU 2.6, I use Windows, you can use whichever one you want though. Of course, I don't know if the other ones work, but I know that um, Windows definitely does work. And once that's happened, you want to extract it into wherever you saved it. I just made a tutorial folder, um, like I have a few times now. And you want to extract it. I use 7-zip, so I'm just going to extract it here, and it's extracted. See, it made this new folder. You can just delete this old one, you don't need it anymore. What you want to do is open up, actually you want to make a folder and just title it games in here. And then you want to open up CMU. And as you can see I have all these games here already because I have CMU already loaded. But you won't have any games like this. So what you want to do is go to this um, website here which will be in the description along with the CMU one just so you don't have to find it yourself and you want to just scroll down as you can see um, Disney Infinity 1, 2 and 3 I don't know what's the difference between them but you most likely want three, but you can install any one you want. And as you can see with the V80 and the V49, they have all DLC attached to them. So that's all you need to do. And just download that. And then once you and download that into the games folder. And once you have, it'll show up here. Once you go general settings and then add and then um, go to wherever you save that games folder CMU and then game select folder and then it'll show up there if you install the game into that games folder so now to emulate it I haven't tested it myself as you can see I don't have the game here but I don't see why it would be any different to uh, Skylanders or LEGO Dimensions what you want to do is go tools emulated USB device and then infinity base and then you want to tick this box to emulate Infinity Base and then playset power disk, there's power disk, there's players, there's abilities. I don't know much about Disney Infinity in the first place, but to the people that want to play this most likely do, but if you don't, that's fine. I'm sure there's videos and shit out there, but um, to get the characters and whatever you want to press create and then get go down this drop menu and then there's just everything here everything here and you once you click on one I'll just click on that and then create and then it will want you to save it to a folder of sort you can just make it like for example I made one for my Lego Dimensions characters and um, I made one for my Skylanders, but I forgot to pin it here along with my other important files. So yeah, that's all you have to do. File error, whatever. But yeah, that's all you have to do. If there's any updates, I'll be sure to leave them in the comments or even just make an entirely new video once I actually test this myself. But because my Wi-Fi is hella slow, it's going to take like an hour for the game to install. And I told the commenter that I'll be recording it now. So yeah, shout out to him, and yeah, like, sub, 
comment, and yeah, bye.